In this video, we'll look at adding and applying a Wi-Fi calling service in the Ruckus One Network Management Platform. Mobile devices with a Wi-Fi calling feature enabled can send and receive SMS messages as well as voice and video calls over the internet. Having an active Wi-Fi calling service on your wireless network allows Wi-Fi calling traffic to be identified and prioritized with enhanced quality of service over other wireless network traffic. The benefit? In locations where cellular service may be weak or non-existent due to distance from the nearest cell tower or impedances such as building materials, and users connected to your Wi-Fi network can make and receive carrier-grade Wi-Fi calls using their own phone number. They can roam between the cellular and Wi-Fi networks without calls being dropped and those data packets are secure thanks to the IPsec tunnel established between the end user's device and the mobile operator's EPDG. Ruckus One simplifies administrator efforts by consolidating the tasks of service creation, configuration, and even network assignment into a single wizard-guided process. Simply navigate the Ruckus One UI through Network Control, Service Catalog, and click the Add button in the Wi-Fi Calling tile. Here's a quick tip. A little pre-planning will not only make the initial creation of your Wi-Fi calling services go quickly and easily, but it should also greatly reduce the need for subsequent renaming or other updates to those Wi-Fi calling services after they're created. Mapping out a list of the cellular carriers, their EPDGs, and the QoS priorities you want to assign will help you determine how many Wi-Fi calling services to create and how to uniquely name each one. So let's go to our Ruckus One UI and create a couple Wi-Fi calling services and apply them to a wireless network. The wizard first requires you to define the service. Note that many times a specific carrier name will be used, but this is up to you based on how you've planned your Wi-Fi calling services configurations. Now select a quality of service priority from the drop-down list and then add Evolve Packet Data Gateway information. Adding an EPDG requires entering a cellular carrier's FQDN in the domain name field. Note that some carriers have multiple EPDGs. To keep this demo simple, we'll add one domain name for each of the three carriers that provide coverage in the area where the network exists. Optionally, you can also add the IP address for the domain, but IP addresses are apt to change, so Ruckus recommends entering only the domain name. Here's another quick tip. You can refer to the Ruckus Best Practice Design Guide, Ruckus Wi-Fi Calling, for a list of popular EPDG domains. This document is available on the Ruckus Support Portal. And if a specific carrier isn't listed in this document, you can either obtain the EPDG domain name directly from the carrier or using the universal EPDG domain syntax, plug in the carrier's mobile network code, MNC, and mobile country code, MCC, applicable to the location of your wireless network. After entering all the EPDGs to the service, the next step is to select one or more wireless networks where you want the service applied. Simply click the Activate toggle to on. If you choose to not enable the service on a network at this time, that's okay too. You can enable it later by editing the service or by editing the wireless network configuration. The summary screen allows you to confirm and finish the service configuration. Success or failure is reflected in the pop-up message in the bottom right corner of the screen. Management of all your existing Wi-Fi calling services may be performed by navigating through Network Control, My Services, and clicking the Wi-Fi calling tile. Here you can delete or edit services as necessary. Note that a deletion attempt will be stopped if the Wi-Fi calling service is applied to any wireless network. Otherwise, deletion requires confirmation, so you can't delete a service by accident. Editing allows you to change the service name, change the QoS priority, add, edit, or delete EPDGs, and even change the scope, that is, the networks where the service is applied. 
to manage the Wi-Fi calling service for a specific wireless network. Select the wireless network, enter configuration mode, and navigate to More Settings, Network Control. Here, if Wi-Fi calling is inactive, simply click the toggle, then click Select Profiles to add any existing profiles. If Wi-Fi calling is already active, you can click Select Profiles to add or remove any specific Wi-Fi calling services as desired. You can also deactivate the service on this network with a click of the Wi-Fi calling toggle. That brings us to the end of this video on adding and applying a Wi-Fi calling service in the Ruckus One Network Management Platform.